One passenger is dead after a bus was hijacked in Los Angeles early this morning. Police say a suspect pulled out a gun during an argument on a city bus. It led to a pursuit through downtown L.A. And you can see numerous police vehicles chasing that bus. News Nation's Nancy Liu is live with more details. Uh, Nancy, as we know that this investigation is ongoing, but what do we know so far? Well, Nicole, we don't have any more information yet about the suspect in custody or what motivated the hijacking, which led to that dramatic overnight chase and the murder of a bus passenger. We do know that the emergency alert went out just before 1 a.m., prompting a massive LAPD response and slow pursuit of a metro bus that stretched from South Los Angeles into downtown. The driver had activated the alarm, which triggered the emergency signage outside the bus, likely unbeknownst to a passenger who had pulled a gun during some type of dispute on board. According to police, there were two other passengers, along with the gunman and driver, who continued to operate the bus, sometimes at gunpoint. Police eventually deployed spike strips, bringing the ordeal to an end, the bus driver climbing out unhurt but one of the passengers dead from multiple gunshots. Law enforcement praised the actions of the driver, the deadly incident, the latest in a wave of recent violence on public transit in L.A. This operator continued to operate the bus in as safe a manner as he could under the circumstances, with the police trailing him for an hour before the spike strips finally took effect. So. Um, I, I think the world of, of the operator uh, and, and this individual um, and bus operators in general. Now, police took that gunman into custody without further incident. The other passenger on board was not hurt, and Nicole, we're hearing that that person was hiding in back, on, on the back of the bus the entire time. All Nicole? right. Yeah, Nancy Lou with that new information. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your screen. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.